my fifth grade teacher, and, and you know, she didn't like me a whole lot because, well, I was kind of out of control. There was a lot of things going on in my home life that I couldn't share with anyone, and I took it to school with me and I acted out. Well, Mrs. Yates didn't know that stuff. So anyway, it was music class. I loved music, and I loved to sing. So Mrs. Yates said, you can't sit with the rest of the classroom because your, your monkey pants are way, way too on fire today, so come and sit by me. And that wasn't that, you know, she w wanted to sit by me. is because she had to keep me in control. So I'm sitting next to Mrs. Yates, and the song that was selected for us to sing that afternoon was Over the Rainbow, my favorite song. Well, I forgot that I had to sit by Mrs. Yates and that I was in the doghouse or any other place, but right there singing my favorite song, and I sang it from my heart. I happened to look up at Mrs. Yates after the song was over, and her mouth was wide open. She was staring at me, and she said, You have a beautiful voice. You have an incredible voice. That was lovely. Now, Mrs. Yates never said anything nice to me, and, and I tuck that in my heart. Well, I was pretty obnoxious with it for a while because I went around going, <laughs> stuff like that. But I went on to have a very successful, over 25-year music career, singer-songwriter, and that compliment changed my life. So, how about we say some good things to people? Let's point out the good things they're doing. You know, we can always find something wrong, right? How about we spend a little bit of time on what people are doing right instead of what they're doing wrong? Mm-hmm. All right, thanks for listening.